Let's take a look at pricing inventory using the lower of cost or market method. When the market price or current replacement price of an inventory item declines below the actual price paid for the item, companies are permitted to use a method known as the lower of cost or market LCM rule. This method takes into account such market conditions as severely falling prices, changing fashions or styles, or obsolete inventory items. The use of the LCM rule assumes that decreases in replacement costs will be accompanied by appropriate decreases in selling prices. The lower of cost or market means comparing the market value, current replacement cost of each item on hand with its cost, using the lower amount as its inventory value. You, under ordinary circumstances, market value means the usual price paid based on the volume of merchandise normally ordered by the firm. Here are the steps to calculate an inventory using LCM. Step 1. Calculate the cost of each item in the inventory by using one of the acceptable methods, FIFO, LIFO, or Weighted Average. Step 2. Determine the market price or current replacement cost for each item. Step 3. For each item, select the basis for valuation, cost, or market by choosing the lower figure. Step 4. Calculate the total amount of each inventory item by multiplying the number of items by the valuation price chosen in Step 3. Step 5. Calculate the total value of inventory by adding all figures in the amount column. Here's an example. The following data represent the inventory figures of Sundance Boutique. Use the lower of cost or market rule to calculate the extended amount for each item and the total value of the inventory. The following data represents the inventory figures of the boutique. In this example, the cost and market price are given. We begin by choosing the lower of the cost or market and then extending each item to the amount column. For example, the style number 44 blouse will be valued at the cost $27.50 because it's less than the market price of $31.25. The extension would be 40 times 2750 equals $1,100.